So we're going to talk a little bit about the ride symbol today and how to get a, a really good feel, the feel that we want on the ride. And um, I think that sometimes we get kind of preoccupied with all the things that our other limbs can play, uh, all the different comping possibilities and everything like that, that we, we sometimes uh, lose sight and lose concentration on what our ride is playing. And so it doesn't swing as hard. So what, what we really want to do in this exercise is, uh, is keep the focus on the ride. And I'm going to just explain some, uh, well, I'm going to explain an exercise how, how you can do that. Uh, basically, you're going to start with uh, picking a tempo. And you can do a different tempo every day that you do this exercise. So you just say you take a random tempo and, you know, um, let's start with this one. Okay, so. Um, the first two minutes of the exercise, you're going to just play the ride and you're going to improvise different ride patterns. Um, so it's just the ride. either a, a one bar phrase or a two bar phrase and then repeating that phrase there's a really good reason that I'm doing that because I'm trying to make it sound better the next time than I that I played it the time before the, the previous time um, I'm always striving to make it sound uh, more consistent more in the pocket uh, just you know better in, in whatever way that I can hear uh, any inconsistencies in the previous time that I played it so once you do that for two minutes um, you're going to bring in the next limb, and that's going to be the hi-hat in this case. So the next two minutes, you're going to play just ride and hi-hat, and you're going to improvise again these one or two bar phrases. So here we have one, two, three. <laughs> So you notice the phrases again. Um, even though I'm playing a bunch of stuff on the hi hat, I'm playing these, you know, these ideas. Um, they're repeating. I'm trying to get them to sound better and better. But even though I'm playing that, I would say 80% of my focus is actually going to the ride symbol. Still, um, the idea is that you don't want to take the focus away from the ride symbol. Um, so once you do the hi hat, then you're going to add the next limb. So now it's going to be ride symbol and bass drum only.
sometimes you, you're going to come across one that's a little bit too fast. You're just going to slow it down. <laughs> Um, and so, et cetera, so then you're going to add, uh, And that'll be the end of the exercise. So uh, hopefully that will help. Always keep your concentration again on the ride as much as possible, and uh, repeat these phrases uh, more than I more often than I did, just to really um, even them out and and make the things that you're playing stand out and really sound strong and and clear. Because what you're really going for here is clarity. That's the that's really the name of the game is clarity. Making everything you play as clear as possible. Thanks for watching.